What's going on, everyone? It's Rich Lux, and I'm with Teresa Robert. Hey, bitch. And we're back at it again, guys. So we're in her house, and we're gonna do an updated closet tour. Yeah. So Teresa Romer, you know your closet more than anyone. Because so. we get more stuff all the time. Yeah, she has new stuff. You made a video, guys. She posted a video, and I'll put the link down below so you guys can watch it. About like this one on massive haul. You well, I didn't do it in one day. Not in one day, but, but she collected it and then was like, oh, by the way, this is what I bought. Not bothered. 250 grand. <laughs> right. So check out that video if you like what you see here. So let's go. Yeah, come on. Here. All right. Oh, my gosh. Every time I come in here, it gives me chills. So, chills. guys, I just want to show chills. my fake tattoo. <laughs> I thought it was real. She thought it was oh real. I'm watching his story today and I'm like, dang, he went and got a sleeve done. Yeah. How much Ooh. do you think this would be? Oh, I don't know. I don't know tattoos. Yeah. I'm saying like probably 1500 Yeah. Oh, do you have any tattoos? What? Just, we have, see, we're getting intimate with Teresa Romer. I never knew that. It's in a hidden spot. So <laughs> you only see it if I want you to see it. No! Oh my god! It's a little thumper bunny rabbit. It's a bunny rabbit. Okay, cool, cool. When did you get that? Yes, it was a bet. <laughs> no. 1999. When I wow. was the US Open Body Oh my god. Okay, there was this conversation. I thought it was so funny. Somebody walked up to you and they were like, Oh, Teresa, do you know this? I guess they do weightlifting or something. Right. And you're like, oh, I run circles around her. She, <laughs> she couldn't stand a day if I work her out. You remember what I'm talking about? That was hilarious. And ever since then, I was like, I wonder what a Teresa Romer workout would be. Well, would you should die. Come, well, no, you should come out and try it. I'll be like, oh my God, like, no. Because how <laughs> you last about tough. two minutes. Yeah, I think it'll last about two minutes because I don't. Ma I couldn't imagine working out with you. Well, you don't even work out. No, I, a li I do a little bit. I do a little bit. <laughs> But it's very like, I feel like you're more intense, you know? Oh, I saw your trainer. I yeah. saw your trainer. Yes, he works me out, and I, but he listens to me because I'm like, no, not too hard. Oh, not too see, hard. that's the yeah. wrong. See, a trainer should yeah. never listen to you. Oh, if man. you say, I think I'm done, they're like, no, we got 10 more. <sighs> I don't know. You need to come work out for me. I, I think I would die. I think I would die. Anyways, look, look Rich. Okay, look. so Teresa Romer got some knee. Oh! Okay, We're guys. We're not this, twinning. Let me talk. Okay, so this is the Louis Vuitton Christopher bag. Okay, up oh, here, this one is. We're right now there. twinning. I, this is one of my favorite bags, right? Ever and since I saw you, the very first time I saw this man, I wanted your backpack. Really? Yeah. You see, because remember when you came and you had the backpack and the but you didn't box. say that you're like, oh, that's cute. <laughs> you know, like you didn't say. It was like, oh, guys, I want to show you this. This is where I spend. This is my room. Oh, right yeah. here. This is where I hang out. Right with, here with the steamer in the back. And <laughs> yeah, this is my little, this is my little, my little section. But yeah, this is a really good piece. I saw this on One on Six in Park years ago, and I was like, oh, I want that bag so much. I, I didn't really think I wanted it because I had the Supreme. Yeah, this this one, guys, but, is really nice. But too. the more I kept touching yours and yeah. hanging out with you, I was like, hmm. Maybe I should get it. But I feel that way with Mr. Fabulous uh, Fendi backpack. You see, he has like a monster one. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, that's not I right. don't really care for it, but yeah. now when I see him with it, I'm like, oh, I think I want it. You know, it's so weird how right? like, we stuff like that. And then I saw this is your newest piece. Yeah. yeah. This, this not. And guys, cute. listen. I know y'all be hating on Teresa. Okay. Y'all be like, oh, you got that same bag. But talk to what you said about a collection. Remember? Well, no. So uh, periodically, I'll get haters. I yeah. love you guys so much because you make me so much money. Yeah. But um, no, periodically they'll come on and go, oh my God, we're seeing the same Birkins. We're seeing the same stuff. Well, that's because <laughs> they're called collections. To me, it's, it's bizarre. Like a Birkin's like how much? It depends on what Birkin. Like my travel Birkins are $60,000. Oh, the same $60,000 <laughs> bag. Like, are you serious? Right, but they're, guys, literally, they're serious? literally bitching that they're saying, oh, we're, we're seeing the same collections. I'm like... <sighs> Oh my God! Yeah, some of the stuff I've had like 20, 30 years. Like, yeah, I'm not gonna get rid of it just because you don't want to see it on film no. anymore. They don't understand a collection, yeah. But I do honestly. periodically donate one or two or three, whatever, yeah. to different charities. And the spaceship. Yeah. This one is so cute. Now you, now guys, every time I go shop for bags, people always say. Uh, oh, you can put your phone in it. And I always say, I never put my phone in my Who bag. Who puts our phone away? No one puts their phone <laughs> in their purse. No one, this, the people just don't do that. I said, Rich doesn't have yeah, that. Yeah, I don't have that one. I don't think it's a spaceship. To me, it looks like a fortune cookie. Oh my <laughs> God. No, it looks like a UFO. Can we open it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, this it's is like, like this is a new piece that literally just came out. And your and phone does is. fit in it. Yeah. And so here it is. So yeah, this is about four grand, five grand, somewhere around there. But so it's really cute. I just love the... The little, yeah. Stand there and just swing it and have some attitude. Yeah, yeah this is a really cute piece. I like that one. Yeah, we'll see if you wear it though. Oh, I'm going to. <laughs> we'll see if oh, you no, wear I'm it. going to. Yeah. I'm going to. Believe me. I love that thing. 
I so, couldn't wait for it to come. Oh, and then you got this uh, rare, you got more rare bags. Oh no. Those, oh my God. This is a I've rich seen, luck sunglasses. Is, yeah, no? I've seen these online. These are the new Gucci sunglasses mm. that everyone has. And yes. I feel like, I mean, there, I it's a shield. you don't have them yet. Nope. Oops. <laughs> Okay, so this is a shield, like I feel like the like Gucci shield. Yeah. These little G's in the back. Mm. This is how you model them. There you go. Oh, yeah. Oh, you want me to put them yeah. on? No, they're good, because I feel like shields are in right now. That's why I have these extra really, really big ones. Boom. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Yes. Yes. You look so bald. How do you feel in them? Attitude. Yeah. It's one of those days where you don't feel like wearing makeup. One of the haters said, oh, they're too big. They're just gross. I was like, Thank you, but you watched my video and I made some more money. <laughs> <laughs> that was cute. Cha ching, cha ching, cha ching. Yes. Yes. Oh God. yes. But Love you them. see, guys, like I just want to, I just want to say, like, y'all guys see Teresa's closet. The first video we, we did, even in the past when she's toured her closet, it's always constantly evolving, she's adding new things, and just like that, I, we as people have to evolve and change. You can't just always be the yeah, same. You can't be the same. Yeah. Exactly. So, so. But that would be like me saying, "Oh, Rich, can you get rid of those same Louis Vuitton bags? I want to see some new ones." <laughs> oh my God! Cause, right? Because then you would say, "Because I just bought some new ones and you haven't yet." So <laughs> that's what I'm saying. You would say, but I try. I always update my collection. I but I do it. want you to. I, I I got the new LV belt in the oh, Supreme. But I'm going to tell you right now. I have on order the Supreme roller. No yes, way! Yes, it's coming. <laughs> but see, you got that one in Vegas or something, right? Right. So you have different. I don't know how you do it. Because well, I have people yeah, all connect. over the world yeah, looking connect. for me. Yeah. So you when I when I get the to? when I get the word it's coming, I'm like, okay. Do you like that new uh, like that unicorn Louis Vuitton bag? You know what I'm talking about? No. You don't. That's not your style. No. Yeah. I kind of like it. I think that I might get that one. And I had, no, these are her and new I, Gucci and I had shoes. to get some new Gucci's to go with the tracksuit because I couldn't ever find anything that would go except for those platforms that I wear that you love. Oh yeah, I need to get them. <laughs> I'm gonna get them. I'm gonna get them. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I think Teresa has. I would say you have one of the biggest Birkin collections in Texas. I would say that. I would say that. Yeah. So have you got any Birkins yet? No. Okay. Same ones. Thing. Same boring collection. <laughs> God damn. No. Same boring collection. No. Look, I, I'm supposed to get two of them and only one came in so far. This box, I've never seen that before. So when you showed it to me, I was like, what? Mm -hmm. The new Supreme watch boxes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And you're all about your jewelry. Mm -hmm. And then this new baby came in. Let's see. Oh my God. Oh my God. That, wait, that one is the the rainbow Rolex? Yes. Yeah. And it just is so good for the LGBT. See, I, I always say, I feel like it's like the Make-A-Wish Foundation making it happen and stuff. Every time I come over here. But yeah, check it out. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Have you worn it yet? Nope. Beautiful. Love. 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 Man. So, yeah. And I liked how you had, you made a video the other day and you guys, you gotta watch her channel because she's always updating her closet and showing you little bits and pieces that we've never seen before. You made the video and you were like, yeah, I have like Chanel over here, mm -hmm. I have a Chanel section, and then you had like one over there that you kind of forgot about. And I started laughing that she had a whole <laughs> Chanel wall. Well, because I always say, oh, I'm, she not forgot that, about. I'm really yeah. not that into Chanel. <laughs> she had, like, I got some, but not a lot. And then we go to walk upstairs and we're like, oh yeah, this whole section's Chanel too, I forgot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, yeah. And I, I think out of all the closet, that's the section I like because I like the, the little bags that you have. Right. And I just feel like, I just, I have a lot of that stuff in my closet, so I kind of relate to it. Like the Chanel, uh, that little ball. Right. With the ring around it. Right. You know what I'm talking about? That one I like. So I kind of like that section the most out of all of them. Other than the Birkin. There's a new YSL up there. Yeah. Oh, is oh. it, is it Swarovski that's on there? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So we can come on this side. You can kind of see it, guys. So we'll kind of try to get you that angle where you can see her new bag. Here. All right. Yes. So this is the newest one that she got. And I feel like people, they don't ever like, oh, she doesn't update her closet, but you do. I do. All the freaking time. But we just don't always like show. And I think she would get it. Yeah, so here you go. See, if it was me, I would do a whole video on just this one bag. A whole <laughs> video on just that one bag. Like every time I got something new, right. I would do it. And I'm surprised you don't have the big one, the big hula hoop. 
purse. The no, snow. I went to buy the big one. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. No, I went to buy the big one. I got there. I put it on my shoulder, and then I was looking at it, and I'm like, "Where am I going to put this thing?" If I get <laughs> like, when you go on an airplane, yeah, I'm going to have to buy a seat just for the purse <laughs> and and buckle it in because it's so big yeah. that it can't sit on the floor or anything. Like this one, at least can sit on the floor or, or put it under the seat or whatever. You have to understand the big one is like this big around. Yeah. You'd have to buy another airplane seat just for your purse. So it just Man. didn't make sense. Okay, cool. Well, you do still want it or you're, you're over it? Oh, I'm over it. I wanted it because it was unusual, but then I was like, no, I'm over it now because, yeah, I don't need that one. Okay, guys, so we're on the second floor now. These are the new ones. Mm. Have you picked them? No, okay. no, not anymore. I'm pretty sure these won't fall off. <laughs> <laughs> so, right? I don't know. This will probably go up soon, this video. So okay. what happened with the Mew Mew situation with the diamond thing? I'm taking them back to the store. Yeah. They got their butts chewed out and she's either giving me another pair or a credit. And what do you think you're gonna take? I was I would say take the credit. Well, if they can't get me the exact same shoe, cause she did say, I don't know if those shoes were released in the United States or not. So if that shoe was never released cause it's a high top. Yeah. They had the low tops, but I didn't like the low top. Low top was like- Make these. you look kind of short, yeah. You know, so if they can't get me the same shoe, then I'll take a credit. But otherwise, yeah. that was the reason. And I, I think bought sometimes them. we have this envision that oh, it's luxury brand, so it's gonna last. And sometimes it just doesn't. Yeah. No. no. That's the way it is. There's the platforms you wanted right there, <sighs> guys. Okay, these are the shoes. <laughs> I'm into platform shoes. I'm kind of weird, right? So this is uh, Naked Wolf, not sponsored, although we should be. <laughs> uh, yeah. And so they have these really cool shoes. They have them like different colors. I've seen the website like black mm -hmm. and blue and stuff like that. So I was like, uh, this would be my next purchase. I just like how they look. Right. I, I think I can pull them off. Oh yeah. Yeah, oh, I don't yeah. know if I can run in them or anything, but yeah. Okay guys, so this was just a quick update on Teresa's closet tour. Yay, I love coming here. here. I haven't you been here. You know the last time you were here was with Cole. Yeah, last time we were with Cole. When we spent the night in the closet. Yep, that was a good video. <laughs> yeah, and now he's like making videos with Jake Paul. Wow. He left us. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and y'all guys love her as much as I do. And it's so hard to get them to be interested in what I like. Right. And it's hard when I bring somebody on, they always be so negative and mean, but since the beginning, they like loved you, right? What's there not to love? Yeah, so I think, we have a good, I think we have a good chemistry. But guys, if you like this video in the world's largest closet, literally the world's biggest Birkin collection right here, the legend, the icon, Teresa Romer, I'll put a link down below. Please subscribe to her. We might do a meet and greet soon. Yeah. Who knows? And you can come and hang out with us here in the closet soon. So definitely look out for that. Follow her on Instagram and Twitter and her YouTube. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Bye. Bye.